I mean, losing for me means like a lot. I think ever since I was a kid, losing hurt always. It's awful feeling when you understand that, you know, watching on the past and thinking, I should do this, I could do this, I could do this. The disappointment, frustration, it was a little bit embarrassing as well, seeing the fans that cheered for you, and knowing that you let them down. It's a tough feeling. I mean, coming to the event, of course, I felt like good. The team vibes in the team chemistry is really good. I think it was great to come to Brazil. I meet the boys for the first time. It felt absolutely amazing to see everyone, and especially Redgar. It just finally felt that we're a team. Come in. Yeah, all right. Oh, cheers. Cheers, boys. To Igor. To Igor. Guys. Why? 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 <laughs> One of the days we had media day, I watched the boys uh, dance around, throw popcorn. It's so nice to be here. You can take some fun like before the tournament, before the official games. All the dancing and trolling, it's actually pretty fun. We practice eight hours a day, so we of course need some breaks sometimes, and when we can have those breaks also with the team, it just builds up the team chemistry really good. This time outside of the game is very important for us just to connect and bond. One thing for certain, we're all sh** at basketball. <laughs> oh, and that's one thing for us. Thank you guys for watching this video. Match day, it means like everything. There's like a saying in Finnish that match day is a celebration day basically. Every time you have a match day you should be super excited about it. The real matches are why we do this, so I love the match day. What a feeling to act that fans. It's nice. You feel like now is game time, you know? And there's nothing that beats this feeling. I really enjoy to play with the crowd when you see how they're reacting. I can't like find out the words to explain how it was insane for me. It's a really amazing moment to see like that people come watch us play, so it's a super nice moment. Our first match of the day. It is between EMEA's team Liquid and APAC's team Secret. Guys, there's no pressure. No pressure. No pressure. No pressure. No pressure. Just together. Liquid on okay. three. You call? Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Three, two, one. Liquid! Come on, boys. We got this. From the first round, it was clear things weren't going well. They actually started the pistol round well with a really nice strat. We faked the split after taking a little bit A control and we actually got the rotation. But I think the mistake was just spacing. Yampi was a little bit isolated on his own and the spike was a little bit late to the site. Which enabled Team Suki to have really good retake with good abilities. Credit to Team Secret, that re-hit was perfect. Despite we lost some crucial rounds there. Five and one now for Secret. I think Red Girl was still like motivating us that we can still do this. Let's go boys. Okay, Chanel, let's go. The next important round was round seven. Losing this round will lose a lot of the utility and ults we use for nothing. In my opinion, this was a must-win round for them. Yeah, Yampi just picked up the pace, followed it forward. The round was going great, Yampi got an opening pick and they managed to get a good palm on the top of the site. Yes, a couple of players are low, but the positions are great. The post plants should hold it. Close it. Oh, oh, Okay, Soul Class decided to play a little bit too close when he probably should have been playing after plant and at the same time Safe decided to go a little bit too early. That brought him away into the round. Desperate for the clutch! He goes for the Hunter's Fury! It's already held the hand, he waits out the first one! I rewatched our route at the hotel. I just wanted to find out the bleach and clean my eyes with that because it was a pathetic situation. All of the ultimates invested from the side of Liquid and it falls flat in the end. You know, if you can't win rounds that you 95% should have won, you kind of go into a little bit of a panic mode. Everything looks off. This map is over. Guys, you need to relax, yeah. okay? We're tunnel visioning a little bit. Often when it's, you're nervous, communication was very hectic. So what had to be done is just try to calm everyone down. What I want you guys to do now, before we start, just 
take 20 seconds of silence, just relax a bit, yep. and calm down, okay? So just be quiet, 20 seconds. We had a lot of fun in our playstyle and other stuff. When you take 20 seconds time just to uh, don't do anything, it can make your mind more clear that what you have to do. We got this point. Zero, zero. Right now, zero pressure. I don't give a f Just run around. Coming into the second half, I needed them to be focused, listening, and try to play as good as possible. Right for round on the board, they get past the first test. It's okay, 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 Fairly weak here from the side of Secret as Red oh, Card oh, starts oh, going oh. up! Let's ah, ah, go! Finally, we're playing the game. Finally, we get to do what we want to do. There's one plant. Yeah, top side, top side. Top side. Top side. Five in a post plant, that's different this time. Round 20 was very pivotal. Team Secret had just got the plant down and they had two alts. This was the first real test for the defensive half and how the retake's gonna look. Whoever won this round had a big chance of actually winning the game. Team Secret do a great reaction. Three people go out to just face Red Guard. Yeah, they couldn't protect that against three people. Because we expected the Kill Ult to be broken, we go into the site. And that's detained. Two detains, actually. They try and retake, but there is just not enough time after the ult going down and it detaining both of them. Holding it right now. He's not stopping. Gets taken away. Now down to Envy. And now the ult is on the time. It's so unlucky. You got off. Team Secret were now on match point. So Liquid have to do everything perfect from now. Finding the connection needed. And there's the ult. Walk going to find this. They have the Viper ult. And they managed to get a plant fully without taking any damage. This situation is really difficult for us to retake. Looks like Secret might have finally done it. Yes, two incredibly talented players, nasty players, but that Viper's pit keeps Secret safe! It doesn't matter what we do, if we're not on the same page and we play like that, nothing will work. Yeah, yeah actually, like when I call several times, it's gonna be B, no yeah. one rotated, like, there's like yeah, three or four yeah, yeah, yeah. What, one, like, after map one, we felt that communication wasn't as good as we expected it to be. We need to commit. If we do something, yeah. we do it together and let's relax. Something felt a little bit off. Moving over to map two, Fracture, things weren't looking any better. Going into this next round, it's going to be Neural Death on either side Ooh. as Yampi tries to up the pace and is instantly dealt with. First place cross, low ahead, red car. Oh, oh my oh. word, Jeremy sent it packing. We just couldn't simply play together when we needed to play together. Oh dear, oh, oh dear, it's Red Guard, they need something more than that, this is just oh. brutality from Secret. And when we can't communicate in these situations, if as Team Secret or any other team, uh, we would have lost anyways. To check on this, yes, they're running through the utility, but they still have to swing behind it's it! It's the Neural Death, they use it so they know exactly where Nats is at. They've got the covering fire, Jesse Bash has the headshot. Yampi's actually pushing this, they're trying to get aggressive. Jesse Bash! But Jesse doesn't care! He just shuts it down! They are unaware of it. He's Thank just getting you. so much info right now. Oh my Jeremy. god! When do we do this mistake even in scrims? We don't. It's a lot. It's, it's like I think 20 of these moments. What? Okay! Oh come on! What is this? Two on the back end. What is this? We just died because we're mispositioned. The thing is, I agree with you with small details, but as a whole, the communication, teamwork, chemistry, all of that. Just Gone. How do you back out from this book? It's already here. Oh, and there's the stun! Beautifully responded to here from the side of Secret. And I'm sad because of losing, because I wanted to win. Yeah, we can see the reasons. It's, it's like after I every loss, you can see the reasons. Red Guard plays the smoke and falls! And it's all favorable! It's all good for Secret! Our official game was like 30% of what we can do. If that, we play like 10%. Right, Wolf, he wants rather than trying to retake with the up, oh, but look at this play! And Liquid are just crumbling to pieces! Because at least I wanted to be up to <laughs> our standard in how we can be right now. So for me, that's an issue. Oh my word! Done it. I can't believe they've broken Liquid like this! Important to remember, this is quite literally what this tournament is designed for. It's a preparation tournament. Yeah. So find out the issues, fix the issues. The main things, VCT split, Tokyo champions. Yeah. 
we have good information to work with. So, uh, I'm playing Euro. <laughs> It's important for us to talk about these things right after it happens, so we get some unfiltered opinions. Obviously doing that is not the most fun thing. You get to hear a lot of truths that you sometimes don't want to hear, but it's very important for us to have that talk and do that in person to try to move on and actually learn something from this. We'll get better. There's no choice for not to get better, and we will get better, I promise you. I think for this roster it's just going to be more of a, you know, you have to give it some time to get good. Because we have so many different play styles, emerging some teams, you know, communication, uh, culture, all of that stuff. So it's just going to take a little bit more time. I know how good this team is and how good we can be. It's just from ourselves, you know. Evolution is a thing that you should accept and understand what you should do to be a better version of yourself. I love seeing the fans, but they deserve much more. When you just lost, you don't want to be there smiling, doing autographs because you feel that you have disappointed them. But we do have the best fans in the world. They were just happy to see us, happy to take pictures, and that meant the world. I'm the fans cheering for us, it means everything, you know. They're sharing with you your energy and you're sharing it with them. No matter where you are or who you are, your support, it means everything. I hope one day you guys all will see us live lifting the trophy and that will be a great memory for all of us.